I'm Sissy. Today I'm at a very beautiful place. It's called Alcaf Mansion. It was built in 1918 by an Arabic tycoon who does like um, business such as sugars and spices. He also bought a lot of properties. He owned 99 properties in Singapore that include the, the famous arcade in Raffles Place. In 1932, a lot of celebrities would come to enjoy their parties and have gatherings over here. It was only abandoned during the World War II and after that our government acquired this place. They spent five million to renovate this whole space. Now they have high ceilings, they have water fountains. In the entrance area there is a living room where the Alcoff family used to have their morning tea and upstairs there's a very nice restaurant. It's now used for wedding and corporate functions and over here there's an open space area where people can have their ROM ceremony. I guess the ROM is over here, right? Or, or in the marquee over there. People like me would prefer to host our weddings over here because it's more romantic and more European style, right? I think this whole space is a very good representation of our multicultural diversity in Singapore because back then we already have Arabic businessmen coming to Singapore and have family and have business buying assets in Singapore. This also reminds me Asians actually have little inkling of how to transfer the wealth as compared to the Westerners. For example, the Western families would probably just put this whole building into a trust and let the trustee take care of it. So whoever who come to visit, the revenues made by the restaurants benefit the beneficiaries so that they don't lose their family wealth over time. This is a learning point for myself and also I think for a lot of people because we are so good at creating wealth but we don't spend enough time to protect and preserve and also distribute our wealth to the right people. Okay, so let's have a tour now.